I was gonna use the living room to record this and then my parents came in. So this is the best I've got. Alright, I shouldn't do excuses because there are none. Yeah, no excuses. 2013. I don't know what I'm talking about. And my brother's also napping in my room so I can't record there. And I'm not gonna record in the bathroom or the kitchen or my sister's slash parents bedroom because they're there so here we go this is weird dreams episode blah 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 but in here says number 22 uh, it's called carnival world and i think because oh oh it's this room okay it's it's kind of weird and it included some people from my actual life but like um i don't think i named them in here because this is, this is a weird dream, but the parts where they're there, I still use it, I think, but with other people's names, because it, it was weird enough that I needed to tell you. And sorry if I'm being like too formal in the video, it's because I'm still like shy to the camera. Like, uh, if you really want to know me, you need to be like, or just watching me hanging out with my brother. That's like the, the unshyest I am anywhere else I'm just a little bit shy and yeah you can hear other people because I live in an apartment and this is the stairs area carnival world it started out with me being put in a jail cell I don't think I did anything wrong but I was being put in one also I think I was Booker from Bioshock Infinite but I'm not so sure I eventually got out right away and then I'm like in a zombie type menu and I was a normal person but just lucky by the way, now I'm the actual me. Then it felt like it was the main menu of a zombie game and I knew what was going to happen. Apparently what ended up happening is that I pressed start or something like that and I was being sucked in. Like I was being sucked into the building that basically contained all the zombies. I tried running away and apparently there were car bumpers all around us. Just the car bumpers, like the bumper part of the car, it was just all around us or and by us i mean the zombies and just me after a while the whole place turned into a place where it was all colorful color yeah colorful colorful and stuff by the way i have my camera and ipod in my pockets but that's it it turns out that the people are getting on tires balloons and other stuff trying to get all the way to the top floor basically trying to float up to the top floor it was like a mall area now for some reason I tried to do this, but failed a couple, a cold of times. Yep, that's a typo. I'm gonna leave that in though in the description. Oh yeah, if you don't know what I'm reading, or you can't understand me, what I'm reading will be in the description. So yeah. Then I get on a tire, spin it with my feet, and end up floating up. Now the building is like a stadium, and I try to get to the third floor while people throw volleyballs at me. It doesn't work, and I end up on the third floor. I end up meeting some people who are trying to win as well. Now that I think about it, there wasn't really anything to be won. That's why I put it in air quotes. Three other people wanted me to join them, while two other people wanted me to join their group. I decided to go with three people. Two of them were real life people and looked exactly like they do in real life. One was Elijah, the other one was Stephanie, and the last one I don't think it's a real person. Just to let you know, those two people are actual real names. But yeah, I might have just been lying in the beginning because I, I haven't read this in a while. Now the arena world or whatever is like a NASCAR thing but not so much. Stores and stuff are in the middle while on the outside you could walk and relax and stuff. I eventually go away with my group but then wander off and get lost. I end up in a different carnival and meet PewDiePie and Marcia but they're behind the carnival stands, not walking around the carnival. Basically they're in charge of like a carnival stand just selling like teddy bears and cotton candy I think that's what it was. I start talking to them and then I decide to vlog this. So I get my camera out but it looks different for some reason and I also still have a memory card error in my dream. We start talking and it leads up to us still talking but now they're driving in a car and I'm outside the car talking to them while it's raining. So we basically walk and talk and eventually it like fades into them being in a car and me like they're driving and I'm just like right next to them just talking, just running. But in the dream it felt like I was walking. I then realized that I'm lost, so I told them if they could give me a ride. They just turned the car around and the car turned into two motorcycles. Hughes drove one and Martia drove the other one. They drove away. By the way, this is on a road and other cars are going as well while it's raining. 
I end up wandering around the city, which I don't know what city it is, and find a bike. I ride it around a bit until I find some people and ask them if they can help me get back. They decide that they will, and eventually we drive up to some snow. We we going, <laughs> we were going on a white truck. Me and three other people were in the actual truck truck park thing, basically like the trunk or whatever. But those three people I haven't seen before. We pick up the snow and then it reminds me that the carnival is nearby some snow for some reason. Even though the actual carnival, there doesn't seem that there was snow at all. I think after that I got put in a jail cell by other people, I guess I teleported or something, then I eventually got out and I think I woke up I guess. But yeah. In case you didn't understand that last part, I kind of just don't understand it, but I think it was like, uh, I was in the white truck part, then they put me, the three other people that I didn't know, put me in a jail cell, and I was Booker again, but then when I escaped the jail cell, I just woke up, so that was my dream, and yeah, I have no other weird dreams, like I said before, I have some that are kind of personal, I can switch the names around. But right now those people are still in my school, so I kind of want to make that video way, way later in life. So yeah, that's it for this one. So yeah, uh, yeah, in words, I, I say that, so, those two words, so yeah, but so many times. Like my Facebook page if you want, I don't really post that much stuff in there. It's better if you follow me on Twitter. I post mostly about Power Rangers videos that I uploaded and stuff. So yeah, that's it for this one. So yeah. In case you didn't know, there's a couch right there.